Guys, AHSF. You know they say when someone's down, don't kick them. These white teachers, they were down. Keep getting arrested for having sex with their students. I start kicking them, man. I said, I'm so happy. Ain't no black teacher get arrested. And Taisha, ghetto name ass, got arrested, man. Let's watch this story. And we come back to the alcohol to close it out. I screwed up, man. I screwed up. From Brown Deer charged with sexually assaulting one of her 14-year-old students. And the accusations against 30, the 33-year-old teacher get even stranger. She apparently bought the student a pistol. CBS 58's Amanda Becker in the newsroom with what we know right now. According to the criminal complaint, 34-year-old Taisha Bolden was a teacher at Lumen Pilgrim Lutheran School in Wauwatosa when she began a sexual relationship with her 8th grade student. More than 2,200 text messages were found on the child's phone that show an inappropriate contact as early as May of 2023. The messages between Bolden and the student contained detailed photos like this one, as well as nude pictures and videos. In a statement from Lumen Schools, staff said Bolden was fired within 24 hours of the investigation. It reads in part, Lumen takes the physical, emotional, and spiritual safety of our students incredibly seriously, to the end that we conduct background checks on all candidates prior to employment. According to an investigation, Bolden also purchased a Glock 19 pistol that was found on the eighth grader during a traffic stop in July. The complaint says the relationship ended in late July when the student requested Bolden buy him another gun and she refused. Lumen Schools sent out a letter to families about the now former teacher. It says in part, if your student comes to you with questions, please reinforce that if an adult makes them feel uncomfortable for any reason, they should tell a trusted adult right away. These conversations can be difficult to navigate. The school tells CBS 58 that counseling will be offered at Pilgrim Lutheran next week for students. Bolden is charged with second-degree sexual assault of a child and providing a dangerous weapon to a minor. She'll be back in court on August 29th for a preliminary hearing. Live in the newsroom, Amanda Becker, CBS 58 News. Okay, guys, back to the main event. Anytime this story come out, it's all going to be someone in the comment section will say, why this never happened to me back in the day. The truth is, you didn't have enough game to entice a predator teacher. But social media makes it so easy for these predator teachers to follow they pray. Instagram, the pics or click away. Twitter, the pics or a pick away. Facebook, the pics or click away. This used to happen back in the day. This ain't a new thing. But the only thing that's different now is social media makes it so easy to trip up. And for the mothers to find out and go to authority and say, beat her ass. Man, the mothers ain't playing, man. Every time the mothers see this shit, the mothers are going to the police, the principal, Joe Clark, and they're saying, beat her ass, aka lock her ass up. Touch my little Johnny, my little Pookie and Ray Ray. Former Pilgrim Lutheran Church. Lutheran Church, down bad teacher, accused of having sex with an eighth grader, buying him a gun. Why he need a gun? He's a beta male and he want to be the next great school shooter like Nicholas Cruz. That was Nicholas Cruz. It's put away. He's a damn beta male. Taisha Bolden, 34. Get everybody with a ghetto name. A bad name. Yeah, these predator teachers, they're usually between 23 and 30, 35. She made a cut with child with second degree sexual assault of a child. That's why Aaron Rodgers got the hell out of Wisconsin, Green Bay, man. Say, you motherfucker don't care about the kids, man. I know this with New York. She'll be charged with first degree sexual assault of a child. Wisconsin is a damn joke, man. The Packers aren't right, no motherfuckers, man. They're a damn joke. Sexual assault of a child on the 16 and providing a dangerous weapon to a person on the 18. This chick right here is dumb, man. Why he kill someone? Because your dumb ass bought him a gun. This beta male a gun. Some females, that D make them do crazy things, man. That D is very powerful, man. Jesus, man. This chick probably killed her own mom. If that, that, that kid told her, kill your mom. What? With Tulsa, Wisconsin, a former teacher at Pilgrim Lutheran Church. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. She's a former teacher. And what? With Tulsa was recently charged after the prosecutor said she had sex with a then 13-year-old student and bought him a gun. The dumbest teacher of the year the war goes to Taisha Bolden and her parents. Taisha Bolden, 34, a brown deer, was charged with second degree sexual assault of a child under 16 and providing a dangerous weapon to the person under 18. This is what happened when your pussy wet, man. On July 25th, the mother of a 14-year-old boy, the mother say, time to beat the ass now, reported to police that her son took a relative car 
and was missing. According to a criminal complaint, she said her son might be at his eighth grade teacher home and suspected they had a sexual relationship. Yeah. Anytime your kid stays after school with his teacher, they follow each other on social media, they texting, they fucking, man. 100% of the time. Always. Anytime you see those sons, they are fucking. The complaints say the mother went through her son's phone and saw the two were exchanging explicit photos. I know the, the mother passed out. When she seen Taisha Bolden, big breasts on her son, Apple phone, that like Taisha Bolden bought him. Man, I know she, she fell out, but Taisha Bolden, that's a BBW, man. BBW. An employee at Pilgrim Lutheran Church said on July 27th, she confronted Bolden, about to beat her ass, trying to make us look back worse than the Catholic Church. So the employee started ass whooping. About her relationship with the victim, Bolden allegedly admitted to the boys staying at her home. You know, they ain't, doing, they ain't talking about no schoolwork. They're doing what? Fucking. Ain't no reason for a student to be at a teacher home. No reason. And allow the employee to go through her text message. Self snitching. Bolden will terminate that day after she caught an ass whooping for everybody, all the staff in the Lutheran church. Everybody beat her ass that day, man, making us look worse than the Catholic church. On July 28th, the victim was stopped by West Alice police while driving a Glock and his phone were seized. Don't get him coughing up now to get a lesser charge. Yeah, me and my teacher having sex. Give me a lesser charge. This is why you don't mess with students, man. The firearm was discovered to be purchased by Bolden on June 17th. Yeah, she had to buy that, that kid whatever he wanted, man. It's like when these correction officers mess with Pookie and Ray Ray. You got to say yes to everything. If you say no, you're going to lose your job. Or worse, you're going to spend some time in prison. Where they're going to play with your booty. Yeah, they play with female booty too in prison. During an interview with police, the teen snitch told a detective he met Bolden in October of 2022 when she became his 8th grade teacher. Shortly before June 2023, the teen asked Bolden to pick him and they drove to Carmen High School in Milwaukee. Heard the complaints, said they became nervous since the school was so close to Milwaukee Police Department District 4. Let me tell you this, man. The Milwaukee Police don't give a fuck, man. You already see each other ass with second degree assault of a minor they don't give a fuck man police will say just keep on doing what you're doing we don't give a fuck this is wisconsin this is why aaron Rodgers say let me get the hell out of wisconsin man they don't care about the kids instead they went to a wooden area and brown deer had sex and all the deers were watching say this is sad man leave the kid alone all the deers were saying that man they, they was running into the car stop it stop it stop it the complaint said the victim asked Bolden to buy him a gun. She had to say yes, and she gave it to him for his 14th birthday at his aunt home. So the aunt was complicit, man. Locked on up too, man. Locked his aunt up too. He said their relationship ended on July 21st when he wanted another firearm. She said, man, I know you try to be Nicholas Cruz. I don't want you to be Nicholas Cruz. She said no, and she will fuck from that moment, man. And money, Bolden allegedly came to Mayfield Mall to meet him and gave him 1,000, yeah, the blackmail was on. But refused to buy another gun. She then stopped speaking to him. Once you start having sex with a kid, you are gonna be speaking to him. Cause you stop, I'm gonna go to the police. I'm gonna go to Joe Clark. I'm gonna go to the DA and they're gonna beat your ass. A search at the victim phone revealed he and Bolden exchanged over 2,000 messages between May 23rd and July 24th. This teacher need a man in her life, man. You texting? A minor 2,000 messages in that short period of time? Jesus, man. Jesus, man. And also read the text messages, which, which included Bolden and the team saying they love each other, and Bolden saying, I want you to see you as often as possible, and the rest would just happen. Yeah, you can see him as, see his ass. He come to the jail and visit you as much as you want behind that glass screen. The complaint said many of the conversation were corroborated. The boy statement, it convicted both charges, Bolden faced a maximum of 40 years in prison and she should get exactly 40 years she should get the max man being so damn dumb having sex with a minor and then buying him a gun to do what crazy crime was in his beta mind man probably gonna steal some cars try to intimidate some people just a beta male man let like, give her the 40 years so folks give me up here on this and peace out and don't forget to like the video ahs here